Welcome back guys. Today is the day we get to go to Red Rock Canyon Campground for a little bit of a camping adventure. So the original plan for today was we were going to go camping over at the secret spot, but I was just having my doubts about it. Like there's too many people, there's too many too much wildlife. So I made a reser reservation today at Red Rock Canyon. So um there were, but there's one downside to this is that when, if we were going to the spot, we were going to be leaving within two hours, like around 9 a.m. to go do it. But this campground I checked in at, we check in at 2 p.m. So when Jared gets here, we got to figure out what we're going to be doing. But anyway, guys, I will see you later on. Alright guys, we have made it to our campsite, got the tent set up, got some of the stuff here unpacked, we got the fi all our fire stuff that we're going to be using, it's going to be a good site, it's just, it's just a little warm today, like it's pretty warm, um, we're just going to be chilling for the most part, show you guys the inside of the tent, Tent isn't perfectly made, but it's something. Hold on a but we got the uh, air mattress in here and everything like that. Oh my God, is it warm in here? What? I said it is warm in that tent. Of course, you basically made a green tent. Um, is there windows? No. The only window is on. Boy. Anyway, we got our generator over there. It worked perfect. So, um. Yeah. I think it needs more air, though. The bed needs some more air. Uh, wait a second. There it goes. I was like, uh oh. What's that? Not yet. Okay. 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 All right. Say hello to the Jackery. Hi, Jackery. Cool All right, guys. Well, I will see you later on. Alright, we're just going for a little bit of a walk around the campground. There's gunshots in the distance. Oh, is that a bathroom right there? Oh, there's a bathroom right there. Oh, that's good. Oh, so we got one even closer. Is it cold water? Bees around it. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. No bees for me. In the restroom down over that way, there was humongous, I don't know if they were horse flies or whatever, but there was a lot of them in there. Kind of had to leave the door open to get some of them out. Christ. Now, if we did spend the night here, do you think we'd have to worry about like mountain lions or coyotes. Probably pretty safe. I mean, why would they build a campground here? They don't have to worry about wildlife. There's campgrounds all over the place where you have to worry about wildlife. That's all part of the experience. It's all 
part of the experience. They just release mountain lions <laughs> every night. So there isn't really a lot of people here today. It is a Wednesday. Relatively early. Yeah. How did that guy get here? This, he doesn't have a car unless he left. He's just homeless. This is where he lives. Where's our camp spot at? It's right there. Behind the black truck. Oh, okay. Cause I was gonna, I thought that that white car stopped, but there was us. Let's head back just in case. Yeah. All right, guys. <laughs> POV, you're getting attacked by seasoning. This is where we're at right now. Can you tell we're going mad. Yeah, we are going crazy mad insane. Well, um, at least we're not eating each other. Yeah. So it's been a challenge trying to light fires. Um, I light, I lighted this, and right when I was, uh, right after I lighted it, we had this massive windstorm come in, and the tent almost blew away. Not once. Not twice, but three times. So we've resorted. I couldn't even stake anything down because of how rock hard this sand is. So I had to use rocks to stake this down. But I had to put out the fire because of how windy it was getting. I don't want to cause a wildfire. So um, yeah. And then we even trying. We were sitting here having lunch. And we we had um, these. And I wanted to cook them. But it's so damn windy, we can't even like this. Oh, no, no, no. Also, Steven was getting sexually harassed by a fly, it seems. False information. That's what politicians say. Exactly. And, um, I just hope to God that the wind kind of dies down in a bit. Because I would like to be able to have a little bit of a fire. Because what kind of a camping trip is it without fire? Says a future a pyromaniac. Um, um, fire. I can't wait to try this. My mom got me this, some of this stuff. I want to try this so badly. Um, I even tried using lighter fluid on that fire and it just would not light. What are you doing? It, don't you see it's windy? It's the wind. Don't, don't know. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Um, and uh, we can't even check into the campground until six o'clock. So we check in right over that way behind this campsite here. There's a small little lot area. The gate's closed. And on it is a note that says, um, you can proceed to your campsite. We'll check you in by 6 p.m. So, um, we're gonna have to stay here until 6 p.m. Flies. I don't think we're actually going to though, I don't know. Because we're already going crazy mad insane right now. What? Oh. Did I connect that? But, um. 
Why don't we hop into the tent in a non-sexual way? Like both of us? Yeah. More of a one person thing. Where? I mean, yeah. if you want to try. It's only be nice to get out of the sun and the wind broke up. Uh, oh, I almost just threw up for some reason. Oh. Yo, we are in the tent and I'm being blinded by the sun. Let's watch Jared get into the tent. We are not gay, I swear. Okay. Uh. Well, um. This works. Can I close the tent? You don't have to. If you don't want to stay in here, you don't have to. Ooh. Oh, God. Now, that's one thing we forgot pillows. So if we wanted to take a nap, it's going to be kind of hard. Also, I feel like I probably should have created a rule that said we take off our shoes before we enter the tent. That would be a good idea. Because we got, I, I already got fucking sand and shit all over myself and all over the bed. Uh, it's just like food crumbs. That's fine. Anyway, peace out, gang. So, um, got a little bit of view roll though, there. <sighs> so, so, guys, I don't know much, how much longer we're gonna actually be here, because it, it's really nice at first, but once you're here for a little bit, like, I think we've been here for like, um, it's gonna be two hours, something like that now. And um, it's really beautiful scenery. Don't get me wrong, it is really beautiful. But after a while your boredom just starts to set in. And um, all you really do is just sit there and do nothing. But this was a fun trip. All right, that's all I wanted to say. All right, guys, so we are packing it up for the day. Um, we had a lot of fun. At least I, I had a lot of fun. I don't know if you did you have a lot of fun? I did. Okay. So, yeah, we had a lot of fun today, and we're just going to pack up our things and get going. But let's take a quick last look at our campground before everything goes away. Now, this here, what the hell happened to the tent? How did it end up there? Okay, this is gonna be a bitch. I've been putting it off for a little bit, but it has to get done, so. All right, guys. Well, this here, hopefully you enjoyed our 1,000 subscriber special. We did it. All right, everybody, please like, subscribe. Click that bell if you wanna see content like this. See you again real soon. Take care.